Pat Hansen, founding partner of GH3, partner in charge of um, the Arthur's Restaurant Project. My name is Shauna. I work for GH3 as a designer and I was the project architect on Arthur's Restaurant. I'm Stephen Salm and it's my pleasure to welcome you to the Crystal Dining Room at Arthur's Restaurant. important for any project for us is who the client is. The client is Stephen uh, from the Chase Group and his, he's really well known for really providing some really memorable dining experiences in Toronto. The whole inspiration behind Arthur's is an experience that is meant to sort of evoke a sense of timelessness. The octagon is just a remarkable space. So, you know, we could use that space as the main dining experience of the restaurant and enhance that octagonal shape and really use that to kind of really uh, make a space that is, makes that restaurant kind of iconic. worked with Unique to create a faceted ceiling design um, with wood veneer and worked through every joint and finish within that to allow the geometry to not only be an interesting space that felt like cut crystal hanging above you but also to house the lighting and mechanical requirements of the space. Each panel was hand patinaed uh, in-house by Unique and we went through a process with them to get to the exact finish that we wanted um, so each piece has that unique quality. There's you know a kind of intimacy in that room that's provided by the ceiling and the and the material of the ceiling but also very very simple minimal detailing. There's two really, really unique environments inside of Arthur's. The lounge and bar area uh, might just be my favorite room in the world. It's, it's so incredibly comfortable, inviting. I think it's a great place for a lunch meeting. I think it's an amazing place to wind down at the end of the day with you know, one of our signature martinis. I prefer the latter. The bar area at the back has a welded bronze um, tartan display and so all of the pieces were welded together to create a grid that could then house all of the bottles and glassware behind the bar and in front of that bar solid panels of the bronze. So using that bronze as accents throughout this in a largely dark space with dark woods and black painted walls dark flooring, we could highlight accent areas of the space. It was a great opportunity for us to remember my dad's history. So that room really is an amazing, not only walk through history, but uh, a very, very 
unique and, and plush environment. The dining experience, yet it was done uh, in such a refined manner, and I think that we tried to translate that experience into all aspects of design, cuisine, service, um, to really create a, a really unique experience in the city. It's really quite unique in the city, and it's quite it's quite a memorable space to actually just to sit in. We had a great experience working with unique store fixtures. Uh, from early on in the design process, we had numerous meetings with the owners and project managers who could all bring a level of expertise to the project, whether it be the mechanical side or the functional side. Um, from all aspects of their company, we found that they were very knowledgeable um, down to the finishing process, and so we could work through every detail um, and every custom finish uh, that we created for this project. Um, so overall, it was a very uh, great collaborative experience. Unique is, there's only one way to describe them. They're unique. They, uh, I think the best, the best part about working with them on this particular project was that I was doing a, a, a project that was uh, so close to my heart and, and, you know, a tribute to my father and, and what's a better uh, you know, company to, to discuss that vision with, like Unique, which has been a family-run business. Uh, it runs like a family, they treat you like a family, and, uh, and there was, it was just very, very easy, every step of it. I think true for me, the, the true value comes when you're, you're minutes and days and hours away from opening, and every single one of their family members are on here directing and correcting and, and assisting in every aspect of the installation. Um, and in many respects, seven or eight o'clock at night on a Sunday. When you have that with, you know, the brothers, the father, um, it's, it's something you don't see very often and something that I hope to be able to, to bring to, to Chase Hospitality as we grow.